Change does not take place until we are tired of a reality that we know is not suiting to us. Change occurs in the life of people who do not contemplate but who take the steps in order to create the change that they see within themselves. And sometimes in life, you have to take what are called radical risk. But can I tell you about radical risk? A radical risk oftentimes creates a radical reward. How many of you all have a Facebook profile? The rest of y'all just don't want to admit it, okay? <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> like, that Facebook is so juvenile. <laughs> I'm a professional, okay? I don't have a Facebook page. And you're sitting there checking your profile, updating your status right now. <laughs> but there's a guy named Mark Zuckerberg, who is the CEO and the founder of Facebook. And he took a radical risk. Mark Zuckerberg attended Harvard University, which is one of the most prestigious universities in all of the world. If you have a degree from Harvard, chances are your resume gets pushed to the top of the pile. Do you all understand where I'm coming from? Harvard is a connotation associated with uncommon success. So here we have a young sophomore named Mark Zuckerberg. And he has a radical idea to start a social networking site called Facebook.com. Can you imagine the opposition that he faced when he said he was going to drop out of one of the most prestigious schools in all of the world and take a radical risk and pursue his dream of creating a social network that allows people to connect? I know what they told him. Your idea is crazy. Come on. You're in Howard. You're, uh, you're in Harvard. You're a genius. Why in the world would you take a step backward like that? But now Mark Zuckerberg is the youngest self-made billionaire in the world. 17.5 billion is his net worth because he decided to go what was, with what was inside of him and take a radical risk which led him to a radical reward. And sometimes in life, we may have a dream or desire that doesn't quite add up, that doesn't quite make sense to everyone around us. And it's considered radical. But when that urgency of now calls your name, because you may play around with, you may go in and go out, but when that urgency of now calls your name, it is then time for you to create what you see within yourself. 